How's it going everybody? Texas Man here. I hope you guys are all having a great day. Please give this video a thumbs up if you guys really enjoy it. Subscribe if you guys have not already. Also, do me the biggest favor of all. Hit that bell notification button. That way you guys don't miss out on future videos or streams here on the channel. You guys can, of course, also find me on Discord at 6957 the Texas Man. And as always, we're going to talk positives and negatives. Talking about, uh old movie if you want to call it that at the time of recording this video it's 2023 and this film rise of the guardians came out in 2012 uh, the movie is rated pg it's about an hour and 37 minutes long and the film focuses on characters such as santa claus the easter bunny tooth fairy and jack frost and they have to work together put aside their differences in order to defeat the evil villain of the movie pitch black and his goals are to overthrow the guardians and he wants to change the children's beliefs in the Guardians and for them to believe in Pitch Black. The movie is extremely heartwarming and it is a must-watch for all age groups. I don't care if you're a younger person, you're mid-age like me, or you're really old. It's great for all age groups. It's filled with wonder. It's filled with hope. You can, of course, get this on DVD and Blu-ray. Of course, you can get this also on 4K, depending on your original availability. And, of course, you can buy this on uh, digital stores such as Google Play. The animation is fantastic, the music is fantastic, and the story is really the best part of this film. You really get invested with the characters, mostly Jack Frost, because he's the main character that we're, you know, following. He kind of has like a fish-out-of-water scenario almost, and of course Pitch Black. You, both Jack Frost and Pitch Black are characters that you can relate to depending on your childhood, which is really great. And the film is basically an Avengers movie. It's an Avengers movie for elementary school people. And if you love films and you love the Avengers and you love anything comic book wise, you're going to like this as well. It has those types of superhero like Avengers like elements sprinkled throughout the entire film. Chris Pine, I'm sorry, Chris Pine is Jack Frost, Alec Baldwin is Santa Claus, Jude Law as Pitch Black, and of course Hugh Jackman as the Easter Bunny. Easter Bunny lend their voices spectacularly to each individual character, and I think they did a great job. The movie is sweet. It's enchanting, and it's charming. I will say that the biggest problem that I have with this movie, even though I really like watching it a lot during the holiday seasons, is that, whether, whether that's Christmas or Easter because of what's in the movie, <laughs> um, you can watch this movie twice a year and you can still have fun with it. The biggest problem I have with it is there's very little substance. So what I mean by that is that while you can relate to the characters, while the animation style is great and the music is great and it's very uplifting and motivating and it has really great messaging, there's not a center core that makes it where after you finish watching it, you want to rewatch it. You want immediately to rewatch it or you want to watch it again within the next week or so. You don't get any of that emotional pull to want to rewatch the movie. I've seen many movies like Lord of the Rings, for example, that there's so much substance in it that I'm like, I, I want to rewatch it immediately. This movie doesn't have that. So it's like a film that you like watch once or twice a year and you just kind of move on to the next thing, unfortunately. So besides that, Rise of the Guardians is a great film and I encourage you guys to check it out if you guys have not yet already. And if you have, let me know in the comments section. Do you guys agree or disagree with me on anything I've said in this video? I'm going to give Rise of Guardians a 9 out of 10. Thank you guys so much for watching. Have a great day. And I will see you guys all in the next video or stream. Bye, guys.